Good night squad, welcome back to our sneakers. If I'm wearing the same clothes as yesterday's video is because I am making it on the same day. Anyways, today I'm gonna be getting into the comparison of the Beluga 1.0 and the 2.0 like I said yesterday. I will be comparing both shoes because other than the stripes being different, there are other slight differences between them. So to start off, the obvious difference is the stripe colors. The Beluga 1.0 does have a bright orange stripe, which is the Beluga orange, and the Beluga 2.0 has a gray stripe. Another difference is the letters, of course, they are inverted. They have to be inverted in order for you to see them. That's why the letters on here are the Beluga orange and on here they are gray. But other than that, a huge Huge difference on the shoe is that the grays are different as you, if you guys can see they are different shades this is a gray I'm not exactly too sure what was on the colorway of the box but you guys can obviously see the color difference and I know you guys are gonna hate on me for having these shoe trees in there but it doesn't make a huge difference to these shoes the shoe trees I have in here are very soft they're not like crazy tight so don't think that it's messing up the prime net whatsoever there is two kinds there's the white ones and the black ones the black ones are a lot stiffer so don't be hating in the comments for that going back to the shoe other than the color differences if you guys look at the heel of the shoe you guys can see that the blue 1.0 does not have any reflection here going on whatsoever but on the 2.0 you do see that they have the three reflective stripes going all the way from the bottom of the shoe to the top and on this one is basically implemented into the material of the heel tab already well it's not really a heel i guess for this part it is the heel tab or it doesn't really have one and then this one does have your heel tab which is another difference but one more big thing i want to mention as far as the outside of the shoe goes is the color of the outsoles if you guys see the beluga 1.0 does look a lot more yellow than the 2.0 and i don't know if that's because of age because this shoe is over a year old now and i think that's why i'm not exactly too sure but that's the same color that the outsole came in but if you guys have a dead sock pair and can let me know let me know in the comments down below if they're yellow because of age or if they're yellow because i wore them these are really a lot more gray even though these are literally less than a week old or like three days old actually and then these are over a year old so maybe that might be why i don't know and obviously the boost is going to be different colors because these are hella worn these are worn like two or three times not really that many times but it still looks brand new which is crazy going on to the laces the laces are different the beluga 1.0 as you guys can see that cross pattern that they put on the easy 1.0s i think for, or not the 1.0s what am i saying on the 350s not the v2s the v ones i guess if that's what they're called they're not really called that but i'm gonna reference them as that the turtle doves the pirate blacks and the moon rocks they do have the cross turning pattern on the shoelaces all other yeezys don't i'm pretty sure that the 750s don't but as far as these go right here they don't have them either and i think that's what i was trying to mention last video that i wish these would have came with the same like cross turning pattern as like probably like the zebra pattern right here i think it would have made the shoe pop a lot more because right now it does look quite plain since you do have just a gray stripe and then you do have gray laces if they would have put the cross turning pattern on this one it would have made the shoe that much better even though the small details small details count on sneakers all all the time going on to the intro of the shoe they do look identical on camera but the beluga 2.0 is a lot more vibrant gray than the beluga 1.0 but i don't know if that's because it's worn more or it's dirtier because i haven't worn them but i don't even wear the insoles on them so i can't even say that's why i think i wore them a few times with the insoles by accident but i take them out because they are a seven and a half and those fit tight on my feet but also if you look at the lettering they are black on the 1.0s and the 2.0s they are the beluga orange supposedly but they do look a little red so i don't really believe that it's orange unless it just looks like that because of the material and if we go to the bottoms they are both white nothing really different there and other than that there's pretty much not much other differences to the shoes other than the release dates that's really pretty much the only difference in the colorway number and all the other obvious reasons but as far as the physical aspects of the shoe go those are all the differences and that's pretty much it for today guys if you guys did enjoy make sure to give a video a thumbs up also don't forget to subscribe like i said we are trying to get 20,000 subscribers by the end of november which we only have like a day left since i upload this video i know we can do it guys please just start sharing the videos thumbs up the videos if you guys did enjoy it also leave a comment let me know which one you prefer do you prefer the blue 1.0s or the 2.0s if i had to choose i think i would have to go with this one because it is more vibrant and it does call for more attention anyways guys before i go you guys know that i get to give a shout out to the fan of the day and today's fan of the day does go to the runner-up from last last video which was monday's video and that is idja whoa i can't even pronounce his name ilja van lynch i'm sorry that's really your first name i couldn't pronounce it but i tried my best anyways guys that's pretty much it for today i hope you guys enjoyed i'll see you guys on the next one make sure you stay woke it's your boy sneaker signing out